I'm wondering if you can just talk about the resilience you've shown throughout your career, your willingness to get knocked down and get back up, because I take a lot away from that journey. And I think it's so important that we recognize you for that as well. Well, I appreciate that. I, I would not uh, compare it to what the fighters go through. But yeah, obviously, there's been uh, there's been a lot of ups and downs. And uh, the one thing that I've always tried to remind myself is like, you only get one life. And if you're going to let other people, you know, define your journey and decide where you're going to go, then you're only doing a disservice to yourself. And so if someone's going to be a roadblock, if someone's going to try to deter you, if someone's going to try to change your trajectory or something like that, you know, who, who cares? Just dust yourself off, get back up, keep on fighting. Um, I just, I don't know. I don't know if it's something uh, inside of me. I don't know if it's just the way I'm wired. Like I just, I, uh, I've never wanted to let other people decide what was going to be my destiny. And uh, obviously there's been some twists and turns and things that you don't expect initially and all that stuff. But I just uh, never felt sorry for myself. Even when like things were really, really bad, don't feel sorry for yourself. It's okay to lick your wounds for a second, but get back out there. And every single time that it seems like something's been thrown my way, a curveball, whatever, I just, I feel like I almost like I hulk up and I become even more, you know, courageous and I want to even fight back more. Like it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like PDs for me. It's a bizarre thing. Um, and so I enjoy that. And, uh, you know, I know that there's some people who try to take advantage of that and, 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 and push you up against a wall and try to, you know, make you doubt yourself and all this stuff. But I, I just, it, it comes down to two things. Remembering that we only get one life. Um, you never want to be 80 years old looking back and saying, man, you know, I should have done this. I should have done that. I regret this. I regret that. That's number one. And number two, just don't feel sorry for yourself because ultimately no one feels sorry for you. There's people rooting against you. There's people who want to see you, you know, falter, rooting for your demise. Who cares? Screw those people. Dust yourself off. Get back out there because for every person that's rooting against you, there's more than likely 10, 20, 30, 100 people who are rooting for you. And uh, it's very important to, uh, you know, to prove those people right and, and to prove the others wrong.